hi guys welcome back to the new video this video is going to help for the people who are writing the nptel exam and who are registered for the nptel exam and who, uh, who for the people who are having nptel exam on the dates called 28 to 30 uh, for all nptel registered people this exam this video will would be fully helpful so please watch till end and uh, make sure to like and subscribe for giving me some support for making such videos uh, let's start the video yeah today we, in this video we are going to discuss about uh, about this ntpl exams and uh, how the ntpl exams would be and uh, what what would be the pass mark for assignments and uh, proctored exams and what are the types of examinations uh, everything would be discussed in this video and how would be the exams and what what is the exam pattern and uh, what about this uh, what about the certifications uh, in this examination and uh, what are the types of certificates we get uh, for uh, for uh, uh, writing these exams and uh, what what would be the pass percentage everything would be uh, discussed in, in this video so make sure you watch till end to know about everything about this uh, ndpl examination yeah first topic we are going to discuss about uh, today is uh, and uh, what about the types of examinations uh, NDPL going to uh, do and what are the types there are two types of uh, examinations uh, there are proctored proctored examination and proctored examination there are these are two types in this proctored proctored examination there are two types like assignments and final marks assignments are decided uh, given marks like 25 marks for the assignment marks and final marks are 20, 75 marks 25 and 75 this is the two pattern of this uh, assignment uh, types huh? in 25 marks we need to get 10 marks for uh, uh, for the assignment for uh, uh, for getting pass and in uh, 75 marks we need to get 7, 30 30 for uh, 30 marks for getting passed if we if we get uh, 10 we, if we get 9 marks for uh, assignment then we can't be able to pass and if we get 29 also in this final final examination we can't able to pass this NTPL exam yeah next the type 2 examinations are called unproctored exam like unproctored exam are divided into 25 25 and 50 in 25 marks uh, we want we need to get as usual we need to get 10 marks in this is unproctored exam this is like a uh, unproctored means uh, without any invigilator at home we can write these exams for uh, 25 marks this is usually like uh, for any programming subject these exams would be create uh, done but i think in 2023 we know we not have this type of examination unproctored examination we have direct assignment and uh, final exam for for an sake of knowledge uh, you need to learn about this like for an unprocted exam there is 25 marks for assignment uh, unprocted exams like 25 marks we need to get 10 10 from this and the uh, final examination uh, 50 marks we need to uh, we need to get 20 marks about it like this is like 40 percentage of every like for uh, 25 marks 40 percentage is 10 marks 25 10 marks and for the 50 marks uh, pass percentage is like 40 percentage is 20 marks for ex for an example if we if we have for an 100 marks paper we need to, to get 40 marks for the qualification this is the type uh, of this ntpl examination yeah uh, next topic we are going to discuss about uh, about the exams of ntpl how the exams going to be like you all know the world rules and regulation exams it will come in an hard ticket only but uh, what would be the pattern of the ex uh, examination as per leaks and as per my research the exams exam would be considered into three parts like section one section two section three uh, for section one each question would be get two marks i think as per reports uh, they are telling that two marks for uh, for section one section two and two marks same like in section three like we get 2.5 or three marks as as for the initial use it is like there are three sections not uh, forget about the marks but it would be based on the three sections the exams uh, exam pattern would be in three sections and uh, Based on that, we will we want to uh, keep the options and uh, in every, for any exam examination. Like uh, for for 75 marks, we are writing like 75 marks uh, uh, writing like, but uh, we don't know like it it would be 75 marks paper or uh, it would be 100 marks paper. If it is 75 marks paper, we need to get 30 marks uh, out of it for pass percentage or more than uh, more than it uh, would be better. Like uh, like for if the if they keep the examination for 100 marks. Uh, they will deduct and uh, for 75 marks and uh, uh, as per percentage if 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 they keep 100 for for 100 marks we need to uh, score like 40 plus we need to score 40 40 plus for uh, the pass percentage
yeah this is the certificate uh, after after we writing the examination uh, if you are if you have qualified uh, th this is the type of certificate we are going to get uh, like uh, they, there are the batch batch number topper or uh, what about the elite or gold or uh, silver like these types of uh, would be there and uh, like uh, we can see that we can we have in in corner we would have some photo and uh, like our name and signature and uh, uh what what are the percentage you have gone in online assignments and uh, what are the percentage of marks you got in a uh, proctored exam this is this is the type of certificate we are going to get if we pass this nptl exam yeah this is the type of score and uh, uh, the type of certificate we are going to get if we if we uh, like if we got us uh, uh, 40 below 40 there would be no certificate we will fail in the nptl exam if you got 42 uh, 40 to 59 we will successfully complete this exam if we get uh, more than 50 then it would be a light uh, and if 75 to 80 90 like 75 to 89 it would be a light plus silver uh, above 90 it would be gold uh, it's very lucky to get the gold but uh, this is this is uh, the use and uh, in ptl certificates is very 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 it would be very useful like based on the in ptl certificate you would be recognized as as like you have uh, learned this from an uh, iit like uh, if in certificate we we would get uh, the name where we where where we have learned like we have learned for example delhi or we have learned from iit karakpur like for example like we it would be iit certificate this is yeah guys that's all for this video hope you got some knowledge from this video uh, like all the best for uh, for your nptl exams uh, Mm, like uh, read read all the uh, uh, past past examination papers and all the assignments and multiple choice questions and uh, total assignments to get good and better marks in in the NPTEL exams. Yeah, hope 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 you got some knowledge about uh, NPTEL exams and uh, the like uh, what about the proctored and proctored examination and uh, what are the uh, types and what are the certification types uh, we have got in these uh, examinations and uh, uh, and the pattern of the pattern of the examination hope you got some knowledge so i'm ending this video thank you thank you so much for watching till end so please give me support like like and share and um, subscribe my channel for for upcoming videos so thank you thank you so much for watching till end